Hello and welcome to another Carbonworks video. This time, yet again, it's another exhaust noise video. And today, we've got a Range Rover SVR. So this is quite a cool car. This has obviously been going quite a while now, the Range Rover SVR. And they've changed it up a little bit. They've put in OPFs and some of the later models and that absorbs a lot of noise. One thing they've always struggled a little bit is the full raucous, raw noise that you normally hear from a V8. So if we just go under this car, we'll go straight in and I'll show you a little bit about the original exhaust and talk about what's going on. So we have two massive, great big back boxes. These are quite restrictive, but also they soak up a lot of noise. You can see going further down here, we've obviously got a mid resonator before then you get further down where you can see OPFs and, and secondary cats and primary and cats further down the line there. So what are we replacing it with? Well, we're graced today with a fantastic system, which is by Quicksilver Exhaust. So the majority of exhausts we get are from Quicksilver and there's a very good reason for it because they are mega. The quality is fantastic and they sound great too. So going through some of the components on this, there's three main features, if you like, with this particular exhaust. First off, you've got the chrome, sorry, the carbon exhaust, which replaced the chrome, which you can see on this has actually already started to corrode slightly. Part of that replaces then the rear back boxes and you have these solenoids here which is plugged in to the Quicksilver sound architect. And what this does is it gives you full control over your exhaust valves. So instead of it being open or closed on the internals, it can be done on an app and it gives you more control over the actual valve position. Whereas on the standard one, half open, half closed. We've also got a mid pipe here, which is this X pipe in the middle and that will replace the middle section non-resonated should give some noise but enough about the intro let's get stuck on and see how we get on Right, installation now complete. And as you can see by the back end, it's looking pretty fruity. Got some nice carbon tips on the back there, but the real magic is underneath. So Sam, if you don't mind jacking her up, let's have a little look on the underside and show you what it's all about. Insulation wise, it's around four to five hours for this. It's quite a, a decent size system. So it is being removed from the front end. Once that's off, obviously, it's then just replacing the components as well as obviously putting in the sound architect system, which is a little bit of wiring just to get that with them working. So uh, yeah, nice install. And if you've got a half decent mechanic, then obviously that speeds things up. We didn't have one of those, so Sam was here to, uh, to help us out. Um, I jest, of course, Sam, don't worry. He's listening, that's fine. Yeah. <laughs> so here you have it. As you can see, the silences themselves are significantly smaller and there's chambers in here to allow when the valves open for an unchambered part of the exhaust system to then bellow out all the V8 notes that you'll hear. But you can shut it up and that's the idea of it. It's not all about just creating maximum noise. It's about trying to keep something a little bit refined as well. So rear box has changed. Obviously mid pipe where you've got the X pipe there that mixes a lot of the exhaust gases. Um, and it's a really nice piece of kit, must be said. Fitted very well, very simple installation. So enough talk, let's get it back down on the ground and start her up. Right, it's down on the ground, it's time to start it up. So Sam, can you uh, give it a wind up? Yeah, nice and re refined, good noise. Go on Sam, give her a rev. Nice. Right, let's open the valves and see what it sounds like now. Oh, okay, go on. <laughs> nice. Okay, I wasn't quite expecting that. Excellent. Well, as you can hear by the tone of the exhaust, you can actually shut it up still. And that is the brilliant part of this system. So yeah, I think the customer's gonna be happy with this and uh, hopefully he's got some forgiving neighbors because he's gonna annoy a few. So hope you enjoy the video. Join you guys next time.